The final game in week two of Betfred Super League seems Castle for Tigers take on winners. Jamie Peacock alongside me to preview this action. And Jamie, Daryl Powell will be desperate for reaction from Cass after their performance last week against St. Helens. Yeah, well, and, and I think he'll get it as well. If you look at um, Castleford's last two competitive games, stuffed in the grand final, got beaten, beaten convincingly by St. Helens. I think they'll bounce back from this. I, I think they're a side that doesn't play uh, badly twice in a row. And I think that they'll bounce back from this, play well and show the attacking brand of rugby that they showed all in 2017 again in 2018. Is this the ideal fixture for them off the back, as you say, of them two results taken on winners last year's bottom side, but a positive result last week? Yeah, it is. If you look at it in those terms, you want to be at home, you want to play on the day you like playing, which is Sunday, and you want to play against a weaker, supposed weaker team, and they've got all those three things in their favour for Castleford. Witness did very well last week to beat the Catalan Dragons, come from behind, but I can't see them beating Castleford on Sunday. Yeah, they made a jungle of fortress last year. Do you see it the same again this campaign? Yeah, they're not playing the pitch. The pitch is very small. You're almost playing in good ball all the time which means you're attacking to score tries they know how to play that way Luke Gale's a master of that Darrell Powell's a great tactician and I think they'll win again and I think they'll cover the handicap there we are then Castleford Tigers to get their season up and running last year's league leaders shield victory to get the win over witness on Sunday afternoon